Alafu hapa mara mingi ni wa Mexico wanafanyanga kazi hapa ndani. Unaona wa Mexico wanapenda kazi za mjengo sana. Acha niwaoneshe. Unaona. Wanafanya kazi za mjii hapo ndani. How much do they pay per hour? Oh man. It depends on the union you're in but uh, I'm 4 years in my union and I make Yes. So, welcome to the number one YouTube channel. So, leo ni <coughs> saini sa sita. Naona kuna snow snow kidogo, lakini kama kawa, lazima content takinezo. Naona? So, leo, ndaka ni wapeleke ni waoneshe mijengo za huku US. So, wangabi munda kuona venye mijengo zina kuanga. Huku ama tuseme mjengo, apartment. Eh? Acha ni waoneshe. So, huku US, nyumba zina kuanga XP sana. Apartment zina kuanga XP. Unaona? Unaona hii ni apartment. Na hii pia ni apartment. Unaona? Acha ni zoom. Unaona? Hizi nyumba ni XP sana. Hii nyumba ni mai kuja. Kuna besti yangu mwingine alikuwa anaishi hapa na mai kuja hapa kumtembelea. Alikuwa anaishi one bedroom, alikuwa analipa 1200 dollars. Calculate hiyo times 127 shillings, Kenyan shillings. Hii nyumba ni kama unaenda ku rent huko nini? Side za si Runda. Nilikuwa nataka kusema Runda, but si Runda. Uh, Kenya wapi unaweza lipa rent ya tuseme 200,000 dollars a month? Ni Runda ama ni Kileleshwa ama ni Karen. Sasa compare na hiyo sasa. Unaona? Apartment ndio hizi. Hii nyumba venye inakaa hivi smart. Uwezi jua imeundwa na mbao. Eh? Hizi nyumba zimeundwa na mbao. Ni venye watu waamini. Sasa ndio hii hapa apartment inaundwa. Unaona acha niwaoneshe. Kuna mjengo inaendelea hapa na kume snow leo asubuhi but watu bado wanachapa kazi. Kazi ya mjengo huko US inalipa sana. Ndio hii hapa. Alafu ndio ile crane. Crane ndio hiyo hapo. Watu wanaendelea kazi ya mjengo huko ndani. Mjengo inalipa pesa mzuri sana na watu waezi simama. Kazi lazima iendelee. So before ni ingie huko ndani, unajua unaweza shtakiwa for illegal trespassing. So, acha nisome maandishi fulani hapa, nione wanasema aje. Cheki nyumba venye na car smart. Nione nyumba venye na car smart, hiyo ya grey. Hizi nyumba zote ni zambao. Hii nyumba venye munayona hivi, hii ni ambao. Hii nyumba ikiuzwa, unezenda kununua nyumba wapi, uneza nunua nyumba ya uh, seme 30 million ama 40 million. Kenyan shillings, Kenya. Hii nyumba venye mnayona hivi na ni ambao. Unaona hii apartment. Hii ni apartment inaundwa. Ni mbao. Hizi zote ni mbao. Alafu zinakuanga zimeko insulation. Baridi yezi ingia. Ha? Na uki, uki hit yo nyumba. Bado joto yezi potea. Unaona. So huku US nda wambia. Bono wana prefer kunda nyumba na mbao. Ndo hizi hapa. Dozi hapa nyumba mmeziona. So before tuingie huku ndani lazima tusome hapa. COVID-19 policy in place. COVID iliisha huku US. Hiyo tuachane nayo. Ndio hii hapa. All visitors must report to the Frana field office. Eyewear and hard hat required. No smoking. This is a smoke free job site. No trespass construction personnel only. We, sasa huku ni kunoma, hapa siyezi ingia. Ofisi zao ndo sujizi kwa hapi. So before ingia huku ndani, lazima uende kwa ofisi, unona? Kita nione kane za pita hivi. Ay, hakuna venye neza ingia huku ndani. But at least mmeona, sumuna cheki. Nyumba za huku uwe, sizi ni mbaho. Zimundo na cardboard. Alafu price. Hii kwanza nyumba venye kompia hivi. Ile nyumba siniluambia pale ni $1,200. Hii nyumba hapa hivi itakuwa kitu kama $1,400. Itapanda bei. Kwa sababu ni mpya ni nyumba mpya. Zile nyumba ni mzee sana. Hiyo apartment ni mzee. Hiyo apartment ukizambui imekaa almost 50 years uwezi amini. Eh? Watu wanaishi nyumba mzee mzee huku. But ndani ni zinapigwanga tu renovation. Eh? Nyumba ndio hii. Sinaona ndani ni mbao. Alafu huku chini na kuanga underground parking. Unaona alafu hapa mara mingi ni wa Mexico wanafanyanga kazi hapa ndani. Unaona wa Mexico wanapenda kazi za mjengo sana. Acha niwaoneshe. Unaona. 
wanafanya kazi za mjei hapo ndani Zika kama naweza muita ni muulize sasa hizo ni hizo ni nini partitioning za ndani wanaweka so hizo partitioning wakiweka alafu ata spray for mingine hapo hivyo hiyo ndio ina insulate so huku US uh, nyumba wana prefer ziundo na mbao kwa sababu unaona ile sikwenye wazungu walikuja huku US wakanyang'anya ama native americans hizi mashamba usiaisema wanaitwa red indians hiyo ni utaletoa shida sema native americans so ile sikwenye wazungu walikuja huku wakanyang'anya ama native americans hizi mashamba zao so waliamua kwa sababu native americans walikuwa wanaishi kuma nini zingine tent zingine zinaitwa TP so hawa wazungu wakaamua wajenge nyumba za mbao kwa sababu walipata huku miti ni mingi wakaamua kutumia hizo resources cause ilikuwa chipa kuunda nyumba za miti nyumba za mbao alafu miti zilikuwa kila mahali unaona alafu tena ku, kuomi hizo nyumba kuziheat hizo nyumba ilikuwa rahisi na bado kunini kukuli hizo nyumba ilikuwa rahisi sana na ilikuwa chipa so that's why huku US nyumba mingi wanapenda ziundwe na mbao but ukienda places kama Texas California mostly sana sana nyumba zao zinakwanga za matofari unaona ya yeah, ukivisit huko nini alafu nyumba zao mara mingi zinakanga hii design ya wangapi mayaenda wangapi mayaona nyumba za nini za huko Spain venyewe zinaka so ukienda California mara mingi nyumba zao zinakanga hiyo design zimeundwa na mablocks na matofari unaona so hiyo ndio information nilikuwa nda kuwaonesha but sasa huku ndani sijui na zaingia aje huku ndani niwaoneshe venye hizi nyumba zinaundwa so nimeamua kuzunguka hivi hapa tuko kwa barabara unaona hii ni highway 7 so nimeamua kuzunguka hivi niende kwa ofisi mpaka waniambie no ndo ndaenda so mimi siwezi soma tu hapo sign post alafu mimi niende lazima nizunguke waniambie you are not allowed here ndo mimi nitaenda so acha niingie huku ndani so unaona hiyo building ndo hii hii ni apartment hii ha acha tuingie huku ndani eh wakubwa ndio hawa sasa ofisi ndio hii alafu kuna cho sijui kama wako area acha kwanza nizime camera yeah so wameniambia Eh hey, kama mimi mtu kufanya kazi hapo ndani siwezi ingia huko ndani. So hii video itaishia hapo hivyo. At least nimejaribu ama niaje si nime try. Yeah. So uh, more videos are coming. Ama ama ngoja ngoja kuna wengine hapa hivi acha niende nione kama ni zaonesha hiyo. Unaona ile pale? Kuna mjengo mwingine pale. Mnaiona? Acha niende nijaribu hiyo nione kama wanaweza kubali ni waoneshe. Siwezi kufa moyo bwana. Okay ndio hii mjengo mwingine hapa. Sijui kama wanaweza kubali. Nioneshe. We, huku US kuunda content ni ngumu. Unaona pia hapo wanasema aje. Sisa. Ah, how are you bro? Yeah, I'm doing fine. I'm uh, I make YouTube videos. Yeah. I would like to show how you guys are doing construction. Is it okay if I show? Ah, uh, you technically can't go on the job site, no. Oh, uh, need high vis, hard hat, glasses. No, I can use you as. You can give me those and then I can. I I don't work for RJM or I would let you. Oh, okay. the general contractor, uh -huh. RJM yeah. runs the whole thing. Okay. They left for the day. All right. But if you're back next week? Oh, next week? I'm sure they'd walk so, you around. Uh, what kind of work do you do inside here? Uh, all the gray stuff on the exterior you see there. Uh -huh. It's called air barrier. Okay. I installed all that, wrapped all the windows. Pretty okay. much peel and stick membrane. How much do they pay per hour? Oh man, it depends on the union you're in. But uh -huh. I'm four years into my union and I make forty-two bucks an hour. Hey man, you are a rich man. Yeah. Yeah. So these are uh, safety gears. Or yep. When you use the boom lift, yep. You oh, gotta okay. be tied up to it. All right. So do if I wanna do this kind of job, do I need to go to school? Or I can just your union will there. send you to a school. Mm -hmm. I just actually uh, graduated out of mine. It was a three-year program okay. to be certified. So uh -huh. you'd be apprentice. All right. And then after you graduate your apprenticeship, you're a journeyman. Mm -hmm. And then journeyman to foreman. So you, you, so you uh, if I come next week, they can definitely allow me to go inside? Uh, I won't say definitely, uh -huh. but if you talk to the guy in here next week, mm -hmm. he already left. Yeah. But he'll be in this little job shack. Mm -hmm. If you talk to him, yeah. he might have a hard hat and high vis for you. All right. And just okay, I'll come next week, okay? Yeah, and just tell me you're looking looking to 
do a little walk around. Okay. Yeah. All right. Thank you. Appreciate it. You have a good one. Okay. No, no. Unda content si raisi. At least to jamaa me tuambia. Imagine anunda forty two dollars per hour. Na ma overtime bado ziko. Eh, hey, manze, kama mpenda hii video, please like, share and subscribe. Balafu, next week nda kuja hapo basi. Adios.